Hey, boys. The five boys and the three ram lambs that I have left are now ready to be turned out. And they're going to go up to the orchard. So they're going to really enjoy this. Mind you, they might run up to that field over there where the yos all are. You guys, are you going to behave? Are you going to follow me up the laneway or are you going to do your own thing? Are you going to be disruptive or good boys? Come on. This way, boys. Come on. Come on. Come on. Come on, boys. Come on. Come on. Woo. Come on, boys. Well, that went very smoothly. Good job, Inca. They're gonna love being up in the orchard. They have all the windfall apples now. They hardly got in at all when they found this delicious spot of grass that they're munching away at. I thought they were gonna run in and find the apples. <laughs> but it's, they're hardly inside the gate and they're enjoying their grazing. <coughs> ah, leave it, Inca, leave it. They'll find the apple soon enough. There we go. They found the windfalls. You can hear them crunching the apples. Now, because they're ruminants, they won't have a stomach problem. Also in this orchard, there's daisies and other things that if they have a slight tummy upset, they can self-medicate. So we won't have anybody getting um, uh, bloat or anything like that. So they'll self-medicate on uh, the herbs that are in the orchard while they're eating the apples. And then you have bold ones. Oh, I thought he was gonna reach up and try and pick an apple from the tree. But there's plenty on the ground for them to eat. And the three ram lambs are gonna uh, tend to hang out together. So they'll end up being three, oh look, bold sheep, reaching up to pick apples from the tree when there's plenty on the ground. Oh, they're gonna have such a lovely time now. I should really divide the orchard in half so that the rams are on one, graze one half and then graze the other half. But I haven't got around to that. I've been so busy. Binbar's having a lovely time. So with an apple, they have to put it whole in their mouth or they can break it or squeeze it. And then they get it back to their back teeth to crunch on because they only have a, the roof of their mouth is just gum. There's no teeth. They only have bottom teeth in the front of their mouth and they have, um, but their back teeth is what they really masticate and chew the apple with. Oh, lovely. He's shorn, he's out, he's in the orchard, and they're gonna have a lovely time. Those are my boys. They're still slightly a bit of pushing and body uh, domination, but they've settled down lovely after being shorn. 
Oh, they're having a delicious time with the apples. Bless you, Brindle. You sneezed.